They said that they don't fancy playing on the artificial surface, but two practice sessions and the incentive of a semi-final place will ease their worries today. Incidentally, Palace have yet to leave London for a cup tie. And in the last round, after drawing at home with Orient, they faced up to a tough wee play at Brisbane Road. Terry Venables used to be in charge at Selhurst Park, adds extra interest to today's tie. Well, Venables has done a splendid job at Loftus Road, but I put it to him that if Rangers made the semi-finals today, would critics be correct in saying that the Omnitoff pick had proved a decisive factor? Before, it's a catch-22 situation. The only way we can succeed is by losing. Then when everybody says there's no advantage on the pitch, if we win on the pitch, we're just going to be lucky. But if they say tomorrow we've got through because of the pitch, well, I hope that's what they're saying, because it means we're through the next round. I'm not too concerned about that. Well, you've got an advantage over them, Terry, because you've beaten them earlier in the season. Just tell us a little bit about that game. That game, um, they said, wasn't a particularly good game. I thought we played particularly well on the day, and I didn't think they played very well. 1-0 uh, didn't do us justice, and the goal was a superb goal, where Gillard crossed it to the far post. Tony Curry rose like a bird at the far post, knocked it back, and Simon Stone was scored. Well, one man who didn't play in that game is England's new under-21 goalkeeper, Peter Hucker, who's played only 12 first-team games. He's 22 and he's been here a long time. He's been here a long time waiting his chance. And I remember him playing in the Southern Junior uh, Southern Cup final against Crystal Palace. And I thought he was absolutely outstanding. He's always stuck in my mind. And uh, I wanted to keep him on when we had three or four goalkeepers. And he's proved me right. Just got in the under-21s. And in fact, um, although a lot of people would be saying that I'd like to do that, I didn't even know he was in. And Ron... Uh, sort of chose him from Sinners twice, which was very pleasing. The Rangers have never got further than the sixth round. They've played twice seemingly here mm. in the sixth round and been beaten both times. Yeah. Well, let's hope third time lucky. <laughs> I was playing in both those games as well, playing at, uh, against Leicester and Chelsea, and we got done both times. So I'm hoping tomorrow we can, we can beat it. So a big day for Rangers and Palace. And a big day, of course, for all the smaller clubs left in the country.